Hey, what's going on YouTube? This is Roman again for Strength by doing a real quick video about trust. Uh, just I mean, risk and trust really basically combined into one. Uh, something that's on my cousin's Facebook. Um, but there's an alarm going on in the background, so it's hard for me to concentrate right now. Uh, what's me? It's <laughs> uh, this, this is something that, like, you know, some people say that you shouldn't trust anybody, and, and I feel that's just very, very wrong to think about. I mean, and those people are always looking for relationships and they can't understand why or they're always being betrayed. They kind of set themselves up for failure, but I won't get into that. Um, but it just relationships in general, not necessarily with a spouse or significant other, but friendships and family and everything like that, all rely on trust to some degree. And yes, that, that it gets betrayed sometimes. People steal from you, people lie to you, people cheat on you. People, people do a lot of crazy things to each other and, and it just sucks. And, and you feel like you're betrayed sometimes. And, and sometimes when that happens, it feels like it happens all the time. And, and that's not really the case. Uh, there's a lot of different situations that go on. Um, but without that risk, I mean, without opening ourselves up to just experience life, we, we don't get out there. We need to actually move forward all the time and actually put ourselves out there to risk. Um, because without risk, there's no reward. And, and we can't just expect something to happen without putting our, put something out there to lose. So anytime you risk anything, you need to be okay with losing everything. Uh, not just not necessarily what you risk, but everything. So it's just, it, it's, 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 it's a weird thing to think about, but you get into a relationship, I mean, you, you risk uh, so much that that you're hoping you're putting yourself so vulnerable that that you don't know what to do that's why some people get so emotional over things um, just you have to understand that you might lose everything um, and that goes with a whole bunch of other different things but I won't really get into that so much but it's just don't be scared to risk yourself or your money or anything like that if, if you really trust somebody I mean Understand that it's there's a possibility. Don't don't expect a return on every single thing you do. I mean, there's always going to be a chance that you lose more than you ever put forward. So just understand that you also have a chance to gain more, and you have a chance to gain just a little bit of what you were expecting. Just don't worry about trust so much, and be be trustworthy. You know, and to gain the trust of others or to be able to trust somebody is to have their trust as well. So, so just just be honest, be straightforward, and be very dependable. Um, that's just a very be virtuous, I guess you could say. Uh, you know, have your patience and all that fun stuff. But you know, get up, get out, and do something. I mean, it, just saying that alone is a risk. And do you trust yourself to be able to actually do the things that you want to do? If you can't trust anybody, then you don't even trust yourself. So do you trust yourself? And if you don't, then work on that. I mean, understand that just because you do something doesn't doesn't mean you're always going to succeed. Understand that sometimes you're going to get hurt. Sometimes you're going to not be able to walk away from a situation just completely with your head, head held up high. But those those things make you who you are, experience in life. So um, some of us are battered by it, and some of us, you know, never have to ever realize them. Some people have amazing lives without ever have to risk anything, and, and it's just fortunate for them. But do they really ever learn? And these people never really risk anything. So, so you know, just I'm just gonna end it there, kind of rambling on. Uh, follow me, strengthbydoing uh, dot com, and Facebook dot com slash strengthbydoing, and I, and we'll see about updating Twitter. All right, take care, guys.